Okay, so I'm gonna show you how I put a diaper together using the G diapers. This right here is the G pant. Uh, this is the nylon snap-in liner. This is the tri-fold uh, cloth insert. And here is the disposable, flushable, biodegradable diaper liner. So those are the four components. I'm using the medium size G pant, which goes from 13 to 28 pounds. And this is the medium slash large uh, snap in liner. Um, the small G pant goes from eight to 14 pounds. The medium goes from 13 to 28 pounds. And the large goes from 26 to 36 pounds. Um, instead of buying all different sizes, I just got the medium uh, and kind of rigged the system a little bit. The way that I did that is by folding them and buying little snap in snap buttons um, to attach to the, the top of the G pant. Let me put the camera down and I'll undo them. Here are the buttons. Um, you can buy them at any store. I bought mine from Michael's. Um, you don't sew them in, you kind of hammer them in. They're pressure buttons and all you do is just put one on one side and one on the other and then just snap it in and all of a sudden you have something that'll fit a size small even though this is a medium. Put the camera down again, put the buttons together. They're the same buttons that you use um, or that you'll find in a lot of onesies. So they're pretty industrial strength buttons. They're not going to go anywhere. So you have the G-Pant, flipping the G-Pant over, and I'm going to snap in the snap-in liner. You see there's the top of the snap-in, here's the bottom of the snap-in, and it just kind of makes snaps in just like that. Trying to do this all with one hand, so it's a little complicated, but usually it's a lot faster than this. I'm going to have to put the camera down again. Okay, so now the snap-in liner is all snapped into the G-Pant. It doesn't matter which way it goes. Um, the G-Pant has a direction. The G goes on the bottom. So this goes to the back of the child and the part that doesn't have the G goes to the front of the child. The snap-in liner doesn't have any direction. You just snap it in whichever way you want. Um, then you have this tri-fold cloth. Um, you can buy G cloth inserts, but those are pretty expensive. Um, Gerber makes this brand, or Gerber makes this uh, cloth liner, or this cloth insert right here. And it's pretty easy, all you do is just fold it over once, fold it over again, and then kind of fold this top end over. And so there you have your cloth. And I like to use the diaper liners on top of that so that you can throw away the bulk of the stool instead of having to wash it off the cloth directly. So you just kind of put the liner on top and then fold the edges over like so. And then you can put this into, um, into the G diaper. So here's the front end and here's the back end. I like to put the doubled over end up front. This is particularly helpful if you have a boy, which I don't, but I feel like most of the fluid collects in the front for either sex. You can put the camera down so I can flip put the rest of this in. And there you go. It's all in there and I like to pull the edges up just a little bit so that they'll fit more snugly and this prevents um, uh, leakage. And then when you put it on the child all you do is, well let me put the camera down again, open these Velcro tabs up front. 
So here's the, the tabs are open now. And this goes behind the child. There's a G that goes on the bottom. And then you Velcro around to the back, like so. And they're good to go.